Welcome back to Hello Nigeria. Our second guest in the, is in the studio. Now we're speaking about music. We've talked about music promotion. This time around, you know, he's, he, we're looking at DJing, the art of being a disc jockey. Many of you know him. You listen to the way he mixes songs so beautifully. He's known as Benedict Akugo, but he's popularly known as DJ Humility. DJ Humility, thank you so much for joining <laughs> well, us. Welcome, It's humility. actually Benedict Afago. Afago. What does Afago mean? Um, name not is finished. You, know? <laughs> you can't run after. You can't run out of names. Oh, okay. wow. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. And what's, where, where are you from? Your state? I'm from Delta State. I'm from Delta State. Uh, from, Delta state. Uh, See my brother. Agbo. Uh, uh, Agbo. Uh, Agbo. Okay, I don't really know. Agbo. <laughs> no. Good to have from you. From the Ika, you know, oh. northeast of uh, oh. Delta okay. State. Is that where your career started? Uh, I started when I was quite young. Like, uh, I think I was still 14, 15 years old when I started DJing, you know. And um, then I was still in secondary school. SS2, SS1, SS2, and that was when I did my first DJ championship, you know, and that was in 1995. 1995. So if you calculate it, still now it's about uh, almost 24 years now. And at that time, who did you see DJing that made you wanted to be a DJ? Well, um, I have a lot of guys that uh, actually inspired me, you know, I'm talking about uh, DJ Jim Richards, Funkmaster Flex of America. Um, my brother DJ Strambarella. I remember. You remember him. Strambarella, yeah, yeah. the Efrebo, Efrebo guy? And uh, I actually started as a rapper before going into DJ. I just said, man, this will not be my style. <laughs> 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 was <laughs> he, was he hunger that made me. you realize your talent? Well, oh. not hunger, actually. Just the love for music. <laughs> and, uh, you know. Okay, and um, so far, what have you said? seen as you know issues that you've had on the job all through for the last about 22 23 years uh, it's, been, it's been a wonderful experience you understand what i'm saying um it's something i love doing you understand playing music seeing people dancing seeing people sweat you understand and uh talking about uh uh what I, like my experience yes, right? so far. i've been able to travel around the world just as a DJ. I was going through my passport the other time. I discovered that I've traveled to almost 30 countries. You understand what I'm saying? So just as a DJ, you know, it's been a wonderful experience being able to meet people from different parts of the world, being able to see different cultures. You understand what I'm saying? So Basically. It's, been, it's been good. And, so and mentioning that, you know, you have people like DJ Strambolarella yeah. and Jimmy Jad mentor you. Have you been able to do that, you know, to upcoming DJs? Have you been able to inspire and train? I have a lot of uh, DJs that I've trained, and they are doing so well with their life right mm. now. You understand? They are doing so well with their lives. And um, I can tell you one of the best, youngest DJ of today, uh, the, the, like, you know, the best young DJ. For, I'm talking about DJ Factor. Okay. There's a guy called DJ Factor. He's... Uh, Right now, I think he's the band's official DJ. Wow. Okay. You know, the guy is doing good. DJ K1, my younger brother, is the DJ of uh, Land 38, and of course, uh, mm. he's also doing well. I have so many other young DJs out there that I've mentored and to talk. You know, I think that's absolutely things, so. brilliant because you can't call yourself a success if you've not helped other people other succeed people, as exactly. well. <laughs> so what's up with DJ Humility now? What, what are you up to these days? Well, Humility is still doing its thing. Uh, like you know, you know, I work with uh, you know, another TV station, radio station for mm -hmm. about uh, 16 years wow. and I just resigned about four or five months ago. Ooh. So, just need to do my own thing. So, what's the plan? Are you going to move to another have, radio station? Have, none, uh, for now, no. I have a, a record label, and I've been able to, you know, sign on new acts, you know. I have this new guy that I just signed on. His name is uh, Bobby Maris. We did a song together called Anita. We just released the song last week. Went to South Africa to shoot the video. And now we're here in Nigeria. Uh, the video will be released 1st of January. Because I also have this event I do yearly. It's called Classic DJs. 
We bring in DJs from different parts of the world. So this year is January 4th. I think we have like about, uh, like about 15 days to go at the Hard Rock Cafe. I'm not advertising, sorry. Uh, okay, but I just want you to know. Come to with that. You know, we, <laughs> you can we know that me. This is December, the festive season. Exactly. There are going to be events back to back to back, and everybody's looking for where to turn up. So, exactly. of course, if you want to find out where the latest turn up with regards to DJ Humility is going on, you can follow him on social media. How can people contact you? At DJ Humility. You can follow me on uh, Instagram, at DJ Humility. Then uh, you can also send me an email, DJ Humility at yahoo.com. You can, <laughs> if you got right. anything you need to know personally. And of course, uh, I'm okay. on Facebook, TJ Humility. All right. Okay. Very interesting. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank we you. had a cake, which my producer has refused to bring into the studio. But Is it my birthday? No, it's not your birthday, actually. She won an award. Because of oh. the future awards. <laughs> future awards. Yes. yes. Congratulations, so, thank you. Okay, so they How are we going to turn up? We're going to turn up with the cake all the way from Chocolat Real. So shout out to our boss. <laughs> Thank you so much to our deputy group managing director for yeah. sending this lovely cake our way, which we are going to end the show with. So yeah. we're going to a very short break so that the cake can come into the studio and then we can start to really shop the cake. And that we eat the show. cake <laughs> with we'll my right big back. tummy. <laughs> all right, that is Oreo by DJ Humility. We hope you can check out the song and the video on YouTube. But right now, I don't have Oreos with me. Guess what I have? So this says, congratulations, Oliver. We're so excited. We're going to start chopping this cake right on set. In case you want to be a part of it, follow me on social media. I will post pictures of the cake, and you can imagine it. If you can imagine it, if you taste the cake right there in your mouth. So thank you to our Wazobia TV, to our DJMD, Ms. Uh, Mrs. Tatiana, uh, for giving us this, you know, this wonderful cake. So Esther, I'm going to hand this cake over to you, so you will handle it. Because mm. uh, you leave this mm. cake with me. All of us, nobody's really going to see this cake. Thank All right? you, Jesus. Oh, wow. pause, pause. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us, guys. We'll see you again tomorrow. Remember to follow us on all social media platforms. Follow DJ Humility on social on all his platforms. Follow Esther. Esther Wanko underscore official. Follow me at Olive MOD. We'll see you again tomorrow for Fest of All Cake. Have a nice night. Right? To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.